Hey Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support in this reading. We are going to find out what's coming up for you within 24 hours. Today is the 5th of September, 2023. Time here in Hoi An, Vietnam is 9.29 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. And if this video finds you, this message is meant for you. Even if you're dealing with the same sign, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn what's coming up for them within 24 hours. There are a lot of details in this reading that may or may not resonate with each and every one of you, so please bear that in mind. Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so for those of you who are signs... Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, if you like to watch your individual sign readings, I usually do it during live stream, okay? So catch me uh, live by clicking on the bell notification button. All right, we've got the Ten of Swords here, my first. You, for a lot of you, you may be in the midst of releasing something or wanting to release something. Um, and the Three of Swords are my first and the Nine of Swords here are my first. Yep, going through healing, recovery. Um, you're almost going to feel like with the Ten of Wands, within 24 hours, you're going to feel like, okay, I'm almost there. I'm almost there, okay? That means it's going to happen, mm, but possibly not within 24 hours. It might take a little bit longer than that, but I de definitely see some sort of a progress of, of trying to release something or someone or if you've been feeling sad, if you've been worrying a lot, Nine of Swords in my verse, I see that slowly dissipating within 24 hours, okay? Eight of Wands in my verse, Two of Swords. Some of you, this has something to do with things that are not moving forward, or it could be bad news, stagnancy. But I feel that flow, that energy where it's slowly, slowly going away, okay? Because the Ten of Wands is like almost reaching his or her destination, but still here. See, the destination is all, all the way there, but close. So you're close to finishing something, ending something. It could be your own feelings, again, feelings of your these one, two, three, these are the best feelings, right? Again, nine of swords in my verse, feeling stressed, overthinking, feeling restless, insomnia. You're going to be able to sleep better as well within 24 hours, okay? If you, for those of you earth signs who have insomnia, I know I don't have insomnia. I'm, I'm an earth sign. <laughs> I sleep like very easily, but for, this part is only for those of you. If you do have insomnia, you can't sleep. I think you'll feel better the next day. Like you go, you're going to sleep better the next day, okay? And for those of you going through some heartache, sadness, I also see within 24 hours you're going to feel much better because this is some sort of progress in feeling better, of healing, ten of swords of reverse, releasing. Again, a lot of releasing energy since all of these swords are in our birth. So you're releasing certain negative feelings or negative people, negative situation within 24 hours. It just, I just feel like you're going to feel much better, okay? Six of cups here is in our birth. Yep, some, it, it's, six of cups in our birth can indicate something that is not repeating, okay? So something from your past will not repeat within 24 hours. If you've been feeling really sad, you're not, go you're not gonna repeat, you know, that feeling of sadness. You're not gonna feel sad again <laughs> within 24 hours. I hope that makes sense. Seven of Swords here is in one verse. King of Swords, if you're embodying the King of Swords, I see you putting in your plans uh, into motion. So, 
because ten of wands, you're, you're moving, you're moving forward. So slowly, but surely. Or it could also be a spiritual way of saying, if you want to release something faster, if you don't want to feel the same way, it's time to plan. It's time to strategize, right? With the King of Swords here. And the Two of Swords, some of you I see, you could just be blocking things out, telling yourself, okay, I need to be focused because I need to get there. It could be anything like, okay, I don't want to talk to anybody or I don't want to go on social media or I don't want to go out or go anywhere that I don't want to go to. That's not beneficial for me because there's something that I need to get done because I need to focus because the king of swords is very focused, right? And the king of swords is someone intelligent, someone logical, practical, someone who plans, who strategizes. So I do see you putting in. Uh, your strategy or your plan in motion basically just starting for some of you it's starting some of you just i see you continue doing what you've been doing to feel better to improve a certain situation however the queen of swords sorry the king of swords could also be an individual this person could be a libra gemini chris and this person is watching because the way I'm looking at the King of Swords, he's actually staring at me, <laughs> head on staring at me. But he's sitting down, right? Look at him. He's sitting down, he's watching intently with the sword up. Could be watching your social media could be planning about what to do with you next, what to say to you next, or watching what you're going to do next. And with the Ten of Wands here, it makes me feel like maybe this person is struggling a little bit, okay? Struggling with the fact that both of you aren't really communicating. Also struggling with the fact that you're indecisive about something. Six of Cups in reverse. Perhaps this is someone that you do not want to have a repeat with. Could be someone from your past. You may have some bad memories in regards to this person. You may have caught this person, Seven of Swords in reverse, in the past doing something shady. Or it could just be you seeing this person's true colors. This is someone who has given you a lot of stress in the past. You could be trying to move on from this person, right? You may have blocked them. So within 24 hours, you might think about this person, okay? Maybe also because this person is thinking about you. I do like the Page of Pentacles. So I also see some good communication within 24 hours with a certain someone here. This person could be somebody like you, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. If it's not that, the Page of Pentacles, it's an offer. It's also a new beginning because Page is young. So there's something that are signs that you may have been seeing that this could be an opportunity for you either to grow or to get what you want. Um, and it's something solid. So I do see a lot of you are going full force on something that you want to achieve, okay? Maybe it's already in motion. Maybe this is what you've been doing already. I definitely see you continuously doing it, okay? Just carrying on, basically. Just keep moving forward. It may not be easy, Ten of Wands. You may feel like it's hard, it's challenging, very burdensome. You may be carrying a lot of responsibilities, a lot of things on your shoulders that I feel like it's also, you know, this could be space way of saying with the Page of Pentacles, it's going to be well worth it in the end. And you know, this sword, sometimes I look at it as like laser focus. If you're focused and also having this tunnel vision, that's what I'm picking up on. Very laser focused, 
having this tunnel vision and just moving towards that direction continuously moving towards that direction i see you just continuing doing something that you've been planning okay but you might be challenged a little bit with the two swords where you could suddenly feel like am i actually on the right path <laughs> right two of swords unsure sitting on a fence in regards of this thing that you want to achieve something that you've been focusing on but six of cups in reverse it says hey don't reverse <laughs> keep moving forward don't go back keep moving forward okay let's see just a little bit more here it signs got the nine of cups here so your wish is going to come true but you will feel like the world in reverse again reversing <laughs> so don't reverse okay because you want the world to be in an upright position you want this chapter to be over as in if you've been experiencing pain sufferings stress once the world is in an upright position all of that is going to be over and you're almost there okay you're almost there just keep doing what, whatever you've been doing. And see, we've got the moon here. This is why I feel. I'm not surprised to see the moon. You start to doubt yourself within 24 hours. Like, am I on the right path? Should I go back? Or should I do things like how I used to do? Or should I go back to someone for some of you? No. Spirit says no. Keep moving forward, okay? Because your wishes are going to come true. It will materialize eventually. It may be hard. I do see, again, a lot of burden. But you will get there, okay? Again, it could also be this king of swords, this person. Who may come back around and try to talk to you? For some of you only, I feel like maybe for like 20% of you, there's somebody whom is going to reach out to you and talk to you, okay? within 24 hours this is someone that you maybe two of swords don't really want to talk to this person but it feels like this person is going to do some small talks that's what i'm seeing because the page is small little small talks a hello or it feels like it's nothing significant but maybe this person will come off as if it's very casual but that's part of their plan, the strategy. And the King of Swords can also be very cold and calculated. So you may hear like a bit of a, like someone reaching out to you, but the message is going to sound a little cold. Because Eight of Wands here is in one verse. So you may be receiving a message from one person in particular, again, who may come off very casual or cold. And this is someone whom I feel like you have thought many times that maybe I don't want to talk to this person anymore. Maybe I just want to like release this person or maybe you're in the midst of releasing this person, okay? But there will be some doubt here with the moon in 24 hours. You may start to doubt something that you've been working on, but don't doubt yourself. Keep moving forward again. Your plan, your goals will materialize maybe not within 24 hours but it will eventually okay earth signs virgo taurus and capricorn this is your reading i hope you resonate it in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below um, and for those of you who like to watch your individual sign readings catch me during my live stream okay and don't forget to hit on the bell notification button i'm not sure if i already said that so you'll be notified every time when i go live and also every time when i when i post your videos okay and also i'm very active on my other channel which is chelsea vlogs my travel channel and for those of you who are virgos if you'd like to watch your individual sign reading i have my third channel dedicated to only virgos all right Anyway, take care. Hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.